Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm looking at an issue that I've encountered on a customer's laptop uh, and which seems to be a common problem for users of a certain age of Samsung laptop. Um, basically, there appears to be some form of BIOS bug. Um, so, it's affecting Windows installs. I've actually managed to install Windows on this system, uh, Windows 10, but it also still allows me to demonstrate the bug. Um, so, when we reset the system, we'll see it restarts. And basically, something is persisting through the restart and causing issues when it comes to try and boot Windows. So, we'll see in a moment, it should power back up. We get the Samsung logo, then we get the Windows logo. And we'll see hard drive activity stops, and we never get the spinning logo, uh, the sort of spinning dots to indicate Windows is loading. If we turn the laptop off, however, give it a couple seconds, and then turn it on. You will see it begins loading Windows, we get the spinning dots, and Windows loads normally. Now what this means is this will also happen during the Windows 10 setup process. If this happens, the Windows will actually detect that it failed to boot back in, and it gives the uh, safe OS boot error, and rolls you back to your Windows 7 or Windows 8 install. Instead, what we can do... So during the install, you'll need to keep an eye on it and see when the system is going to reboot. So if we set this machine to restart, just from the login screen, it would still demonstrate the same problem. It would fail to load Windows. So as it restarts, And basically, you'll have to watch the Windows install, and as it goes to do this, you're going to have to be on the ball. Um, so, as soon as the screen goes black, start pressing the F2 key. And boot into the BIOS. Now, turn the computer off. Wait a couple seconds. Back on. Booting it into the BIOS isn't essential, but it basically gives you a break point so you know you're going to turn it off before it hits the bootloader. So now we can see it's restarted, and you can use this same trick to get, your, get it so that you can progress through the install, get Windows 10 onto your Samsung laptop. Just be aware that doing this, whenever it goes to restart, it's going to hang on that initial screen um, and you'll have to power the laptop off and back on to get it to boot Windows. We can also make a change by using BCD Edit. Um, so I will cut to the screen in a second and we'll see by using this command on the screen we prevent Windows trying to do the automatic recovery. So if for any reason it boots in you turn it off when you turn it back on it will try and unnecessarily do the automatic recovery because it's detected a failed startup. So by using this, we avoid that situation. I hope you found this video useful. Be sure to subscribe to my channel to see more hints and tips and other videos, and check out what we've got on if you want to see more. Thanks for watching.